How's it going everyone? My name is Roskai and I'll be opening up 50 hidden faith packs in anniversary to our 50 subscriber hit count which we hit a week ago but alright I will just still do it. Um, I fixed these codes from my best friend's uh, Ascension. Uh, his name is in the screen right now. Uh, that's his discord so make sure to hit him up if you want some codes. He sells them for the best prizes you could ever find like I'm not even kidding it's a fact. His, his prizes are just absolutely blasting. They're so good. They're really, really, really cheap. Um, so yeah, I really recommend you guys checking them out. Um, yep. So he's in the subtitle. And now we'll open up some packs. So yeah, 50 will be a lot. I have no clue how long it will take. But yeah, let's get cracking, man. So our first pack. Will we have some first pack of local lads? I have opened up um, a lot of um, Hidden Fates packs before. But a lot I mean 20. <laughs> Oh, we already got a holo, a Brox training holo. Very nice, very nice indeed. Okay, let's get open with the other one. Let's just not take too many, too much time. Oh, we've got that star you from the um, from the Mew V video, which is absolutely just blowing up. And we have a holo energy water, very got, very nice. And another holo Vaporeon. Oh, that's just the perfect match. Not the best competitive card to be honest really really bad but yeah it's a nice card to look at anyways and who doesn't like Vaporeon come on nice star you okay Ooh, a reverse uh, I mean a hollow holographic um, psychic energy love it love it and at first uh, that's a Lapras that's just a beautiful Lapras man we're only four uh, left man we have only four, opened four not good not good okay okay so we have a reverse and that is Oh wait, what? A holo? So this must be something good then. No? Oh my god, yeah, and it's and it is a shining inkay. Now these these are pretty pretty well traded now. Like no, not now. They used to be very well traded for for um what's his name? Malamar, Malamar. For Malamar, uh, yeah, you know. <laughs> from uh, that Lost Thunder, I think. I think it's from Lost Thunder. Alrighty. Geodude, reverse hollow, and another Lapras. Okay, good. Ekans, snake backwards. Ooh, we got a Jinx. I like this Jinx. It's a good one. And Clef Fable, and a Shining. Ooh, Shining Rockruff. I like this card. Yeah, man, I love the Shining cards. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Open another one. It's gonna take a while, lad, so uh, if you want. I will do a recap in the end uh, about all our pulls. So yeah, stay tuned for that. You can just skip ahead to the end if you like. I don't really mind. Okay, so we got another Lieutenant Search strategy. Perhaps one deck about it before it rotates. Because uh, yeah, we need to be quick. <laughs> Ooh, we got a Raichu GX, which I already have from uh, from something, but the, the Bromo one. And then our Shining Pokemon is... Ooh, Shining... Um, Zerk tree, very nice, very nice indeed. Ah, oh, looks beautiful. Okay, another one. We're almost ten in, lads. Only ten, to be honest. It goes very slow. Okay, reverse all the Charmander. Who doesn't like him? And a Butterfree. A very weak stage two. Jesus Christ, man. Now this is just very bad. <laughs> Doing any damage for two energies as a stage two. Now that's just. No, nah. So I always say all cards have something to go in, but not that one, man. Not that one. And ooh, Blaine's last stand. You can play this card only when your last card is on your hand. Draw two cards for each fire Pokemon you have in play. Ah, yeah, yeah, I remember now. I've never played with it. I've never seen it. Oh, seen played against me, but could work. Okay, and we'll be having a shining again. So we have Mr. Mime, which I do like. And our shining is. Ooh, shining Vulpix! Wow, that's just a white screen, man. <laughs> this Vulpix is very nice. That's the best Vulpix that there is, to be honest. There's no better Vulpix in the game. I think. That's what I think, yeah. Another shining pack! So we have a reverse hollow clay fable and. No shining. Oh, okay, okay. No, that's a. Uh... Ah, yeah, yeah, okay. So when the second to the last pack 
uh, card is a reverse hollow. It is not a shiny. And it is not a shiny. So it is. Ooh, a hollow Zapdos. I like it. For flip four coins, for each head, search your deck for a lightning inner energy card and attach it to one of your Pokemon GX or EX. Actually, that's so good. I have it, but I've never used it. Jesus, that's actually very good. Flipping four coins, you can be attaching four energies at max. That's pretty good. That's really good, actually. Wow. Okay, Golem and ooh, Gyarados GX. There's not a, there's not much of those GX cards that are just normal. Most of them are shiny. I remember I once pulled a or oh, another of those Zapdos. Oh man. Ooh. Okay, we already have three of those Zapdos. That's good. I like it. We pulled only four or two though. That's good. So I'm really looking forward to see some shiny uh, GX Pokemon because I love them. As long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, whenever your opponent attaches an energy from their hands to one of their Pokemon, put two damage counters on that Pokemon. Wow, okay, that's actually very good. If you compare that with uh, Drag Dragozolt, you have Dragozolt with its ability, is, which has, does the same, so you have full damage, and then another Dragozolt, goddamn, you can be doing 100 damage with those damage counters. Oof. Ima imagine if he's like a fire deck. Erika's Hospitality, very nice. It's a Hidden Fates version though. Ooh, a Shining Vault Up. I like it. God damn, it looks good. Very, very good. So, we're almost halfway, lads. Almost. To be honest, I'm very, I'm very much enjoying this. Ooh, lovely, lovely Snorlax. And we have a Zapdos, a Moltres Zapdos, and Articuno. Alternate Art GX. Wait, is this alternate art? I think so, right? No, okay, it's not. Oops. <laughs> I thought I really thought this was not the normal version. <laughs> it was, I thought it was like um, the Zerark, Greninja, where you have this one as well. God damn, it looks good. As a normal card, regular card, it looks very good. I like it. Alright. So, our next one is... Ah, another two. So we have a Hollow Brock's training, and this will be a shining card. Ooh, shining Ni Ni Lego GX. When you play this Pokemon from your hands onto your bench, you may leave both active Pokemon confused and poisoned. Good, that's good. And then you have Lock Up, and then the GX is add two car uh, at the top, add the top two cards of your opponent's deck into their prizes. Oh wow, that's just so annoying. <laughs> Jesus. If you use that against someone, ouch. Okay. A Snorlax and... A Shining Zygarde GX! Oh god, that's a good pull. I like it. That's so. That's two Shining GX Pokemon in a row. Damn, and that was a 30th pack. 30th pack? 30th? I have no clue, man. I'm not native English, if you, as you can see. So we already have three tradable... Um, water hollow energy, very good. And another Brox training. So attach an energy from hand to one of your Geodude, Graveler, Golem, Onyx GX, Cubone, Rhyhorn, Rhydon, and Sudowoodoo. Perhaps this will be very good for a uh, Rhy Rhyhorn. No, Rhyperior actually, but yeah, for a Rhyperior deck. But like the stage one, stage two, of course, because otherwise it wouldn't work. Uh. Misty's, yeah, that's a gym, that's good. And a Wigglytuff GX. Meh, meh. All those GX are not the best. Like, they're, they're not re really promising, to be honest. Except for that Geodude, um, Gyarados and Starmie, they have something to go for. I mean, Onyx, sorry. Ooh, oh, that's a very good pull. I like this card a lot. So, this is like a Rock GX shiny version. So, with a bloodthirsty eyes. When you play this Pokemon from your hands to evolve, or, um, yeah, to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may switch one of your opponent's benched Pokemon with Direct. This boss is always putting in a Pokemon. Very good, very good. And I like the GX as well. It's it's a fun card to play with, and it has been played in Worlds as well for its ability, of course. And to finish up something off, some things off, because 110 was enough for all those Lightning decks. Okay. 
Oh, a hollow Eevee. I like a hollow Eevee. We have four of them huh, already. That's good, but the Eevee itself is not the best, so... Yeah. Won't be used, probably. Because there's an Eevee that just searches... Oh, another one. There's an Eevee that just searches for its evolution in the deck as ability, and then evolves. That's just the way, way better. Okay, Blaine's last stand again, and... Another E! Okay, that's that's almost three E in a row. There was just one pack between them. Wow. Okay, that, so that was happen that that's what happens when you play when you're talking shit about some card. This is gonna be a hollow. Uh, uh shining, shining. Shining Vulpix again! Oh we have two already. Very nice. Okay. Ooh, a grass energy. Very oh man, that's so good. Looks good. And a full art Giovanni's exile. Perfect. So this is our first full art pull. I already had one. God damn man. There are some mill decks that use this card and I like it. I like it a lot. I really want to make one actually. I, I I've never made a um, a mill deck before or played with one. But it does sound like fun to uh, construct one of those. Another Brox training, so we officially now have a full playset. Very nice. And then the others that we will get is tradable. Which will no, no one no one will trade for it. But. Huh? Another version of Akans? He has two versions in the set alone. Innovates, innovates. <laughs> wow, okay. And this build. Oh, it's gonna be shiny. Woo, shining Celestia. Celestia. Wow, that's a big attack cost. So, one steel and then four colors. Moon Riker. Moonraker, sorry. Uh, 160 damage. If the total of both players' remaining prize cards is exactly 6, this deck can be used for for steel energy. So for 1 steel energy, I imagine. So then you 160. Oh, this is just perfect to start off with, actually. 160 for just 1 steel. <laughs> That's great. Okay. Golem. Okay, okay. And a shining Gabite? Wait, what? <laughs> Why does this one have a shiny version? What is this? Okay, that's very confusing. Oh, okay, so the whole evolution line is shiny. <gasps> Wait, no, it's not shiny though. This one is not shiny. <laughs> but oh damn, man. Oh, that's so cool. Imagine all of those in the one deck. Oh, that would be so cool, man. Alright, we're actually already halfway through, I didn't even notice. So we have 18 packs left after this. Okay, we have a lot of Lieutenant Surges here. And a Brock's Grid. Wow, that's so f that's <laughs> that's five supporters in one pack. That's almost an ETB, man. And uh, an Elite Trainer, no, an Elite Trainer Toolkit. No, it's just a Trainer Toolkit. <gasps> oh, the shiny uh, Fire Energies. Man, I want more. Imagine a whole deck with all those Fire Energies. We have already seven EVs. Jesus. <laughs> Okay, 16 packs remaining, man. Good, good. Oh man, another Eevee. And another Eevee. Okay, I'm seeing too many Broxes now. Oh man, I really hate Zero Arc Shiny. I really hate that card, man. It's so bad. I'm just kidding, guys. Don't tell them. Don't tell them. I'm kidding. King's gone. And Zero Arc. Oh. <laughs> just talking shit about some card and you will get it. Oh man, I just, just I, I don't like Guzma, man. Guzma is just so such a shit character. I was being shit. Oh, okay, that's actually a pretty good card. And by the way, I love Guzma. Guzma is fucking cool. That's actually a pretty okay. Pull that Charizard. <laughs> For some reason, Charizard is still fucking expensive. I hate it. I don't like Charizard that much. It doesn't deserve all that attention. But alright. He's a, he's a pretty nice Pokemon, yeah. But it's just not... So nice for me that everyone loves it too much. <laughs> like Mew on itself is also, also very cool, right? <laughs> Alrighty. And a Mew. A regular Mew. Okay, we haven't had many pulls last packs. So we have still 10 remaining. That's actually still a lot. <laughs> we have more than an ETB at this point. Still, after all these packs. Golem! Okay, okay. And this is our 10th pack. This should be a good one, right? Ooh, 
Ooh, I can feel it coming. Oh, it's a, okay, it's actually still an ultra rare pool, you know. Okay, okay. Jinx, and another normal Clefable. I do feel like we're gonna pull something else pretty big. This is gonna be it, man. Yeah! Oh my god, that's beautiful! A full art lady! Oh, I love lady, man. It's such a fun card to play with. And we've got a full art, man. Oh, yeah. I'm happy. Oh, I'm so happy. Jesus Christ, mate. I have never actually looked at her as a, as a full art. But, man, and we got a full playset now. <laughs> oh, man, I like that. I love that. Okay, okay. So we have two full arts already. Well, I, c I shouldn't say already because <laughs> we have pulled more. We have opened more packs than a whole boost box already, and we've only pulled two full arts. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Now that's a bad look, to be honest. But it's not over yet. Oh yeah, and we pulled some shiny Pokemon. That's true. And ooh, Jesse and James, but it's banned. I don't know why. Each player discards two cards from the hand. You just you, your opponent discards first. I have no clue why it's so good. Well, actually, no, no, no. It's very, very good in stall. Yeah, it's just a stall card and a, and a, and a mill deck. So, Onyx GX. <gasps> this is gonna be good. By the way, this first time we see an Onyx GX. Jesus. <laughs> and ooh, another Zygarde GX shiny. Oh my god, that looks perfect. We should make a deck about him then. Yeah, we should, man. We should. Zygarde GX, he has some, a lot of cards that help him, like, it's all Zygarde focused. Another plane last stance, okay. This is our second to final pack, man. Our second to final after 50. Literally each of these packs is a subscriber. Okay, our last pack, man. Our last pack. This is our first subscriber ever. Come on, man, this is gonna be it. Nah, probably not gonna be that much. I'm very happy that we got a double shiny Pokemon. Oh, oh, it's two, it's two. Okay, I'm not feeling it, man. Ooh! <laughs> no way! No way, man! This is insane! We got the best card! Oh, Jesus Christ! No way! <laughs> this is the last card, the last pack. <laughs> we got the shiny Charizard GX! <laughs> I don't even know how much this is worth. This was, this used to be so fucking expensive. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Oh, yo, yo, this is insane. This is insane, man. Ooh, ooh, shit, man. Ooh, shit, that's a good, good ender. Right there, man. Oh, I'm gonna send that to, the, to, my, to my buddy. He needs to see this, man. He needs to see this. Oh, my God. Last pack. Last pack. <laughs> I just repeat last pack to him now. God damn, man. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's take a look at all, all the things that we got. Damn, I hope I didn't scream your ears off, man. I will make sure that it's not too loud, okay, in the edit. Um, so, let's filter this all up for Hidden Fates. So, this should be right here, right? No, 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 it's, not, it's in the moon. Hidden Fates, yeah. There it is. So let's filter it up to GX Pokemon. So in total, we got one Charizard. No, we actually shoot Charizard, but that's okay. So we got two Char Char Charizard VX, uh, GX. <laughs> sorry. Uh, so one regular, then two Gyarados GX, one Zap uh, Molt, uh, an MZA, <laughs> an MZA GX card, which is very nice. One Onix, one Raichu, one Wigglytuff. And now, okay, so those GX are not categorized as GX there. As a shiny Pokemon, right? So we have two Alolan Vulpix, shiny, very nice. And we also have one Celesteela. We have <laughs> one damn Charizard GX. God damn, man. I'll put the price on the video right now. How much is this worth, mate? I, I remember this used to be so fucking expensive. Everyone was looking for it. And I just got it in the last pack, man. Oh, Jesus, that's such a good clickbait title, wow. <laughs> okay, so we got uh, Gebite as well, which I I, will I do enjoy, man. I've always wanted to make something about 
garbage dump. Uh, and an inkey as well, which I think is still worth something. Then we have a Lycan Rock GX, which I also think is worth about two packs, maybe. They also have this one, which is not worth anything, but I do enjoy the card, it looks good. And perhaps usable in some decks about conditions, which is okay. Then we also have one Rock Rough Shiny, so we can actually compare this perfectly with this Lycan Rock GX. We have just two, we have literally have a shiny evolution line. Perfect, wow. We also have a Scyther, which we did not pull in this video to be honest, I forgot. Uh, we also have a shiny Voltorb, oh man, it looks so good, I love this card, it looks perfect. Gonna be perfect for one of those, wait, wait, does it have, is there, yeah, 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 see, it's gonna be perfect for this electrode. Goddamn. Imagine if we pulled that electrode as well. And we also have a Zerg tree, which, I mean, it's alright. It's not the best to be honest, but it's okay, it's okay. And then our last, so we got two Zygarde GX and I will show So very cool that we have two, uh, two shiny ones. But all right, so. Oh my God, yeah, and I also forgot to mention those full art trainers. Jesus Christ, I'm such a dumbass. So we have Lady, full art Lady, I love this man. Look at it, it's such a beautiful card. Man, 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 I love this. I love that card so much. So, so fucking much. And then, what was the other? Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Giovanni's Exile. So, yeah, we have this Giovanni's Exile. And I will quickly show why I uh, like the Giovanni's Exile. An idea for, an, an, an ID for the future video. But for the meantime, okay, um, check out the Ascension. And, yeah, see you later. Have a good day further. Also, I uh, forgot to mention, please check out Ascension. Um, I, I, I will put the, his Discord name as well in the description. So yeah, check him out if you want some codes for a very, very cheap price. And yeah, have a good day for lads.